I don't know, guys. I, I just don't feel like this dude, five seconds of summer song, maybe it's not that great, it's not that bad, but it's all time low, dude. Oh. What's up everyone, John from Beyond AR TV. Sorry, it sounds like I have a cold, it's because I have a cold. Straight to DVD 2 is just around the corner, all time low releasing the follow up to their hit DVD that I really enjoyed. It was a lot of fun, I really loved some of the performances on there. Party Song, Walk of Shame, probably my favorite one appearing on that DVD. That came around right after Nothing Personal, and I was excited to hear that they were doing another one of these. I'm a big fan of All Time Low. I even really enjoyed their last album, Future Hearts, even if I did feel like it was a step down in quality after Don't Panic, an album that I thoroughly enjoyed, a big step up from the album that preceded that dirty work. And with this new track, I really do feel like they're trying to appeal to a different demographic, and I'm not sure how much of a fan I am of it. I actually just saw All Time Low live, not even a week ago at this point, and I enjoyed the performances. I missed part of their set because so much traffic on the way there, but I really did enjoy their performances. I love seeing them. This is my second time. I love watching live videos, just the interactions that they have with each other, Jack and Alex on stage, and of course with the audience as well. Thoroughly engaging, but this new track, Take Cover, seems to be kind of following a different route, and like I said, it feels like they're going for more of that like a uh, pop friendly rock style that bands like Five Seconds of Summer are really cashing in on. But Five Seconds of Summer's last song actually was a huge step up for them. Girls Talk Boys, probably one of my favorite pop songs of the year so far. It opens with kind of a promising thing. I was thinking maybe it would start off with these kind of electronics. It's kind of catchy. It gets stuck in your head right off the bat. And it, it does do, I, I guess, its job with that. But I'm looking for it to just kind of break through. I'm maybe looking for like the roar of a guitar, but instead it's more of like a nuanced and subtle groove all throughout. I'm not saying that that's a bad thing, but for a band like All Time Low, the guitar is normally much more prominent and in your face, and whenever the drum pattern feels more basic and limited and you don't have that guitar either, there's really not that much to pay attention to other than Alex's voice and of course the vocals. And I'm not saying that they're bad here by any means, it's just that they're kind of at a flat line. The lyrics are nothing special. And I understand that this is kind of like a leftover from Future Hearts and we're getting it because maybe it didn't really fit with the album, which I definitely get. Tracks like Edge of Tonight didn't fit at all. And this is definitely better than some of the worst songs that I thought were on Future Hearts. And I would have easily substituted this for a track like Bail Me Out or Edge of Tonight. But I feel like it's somewhere in middle ground territory. It's kind of like an all-time low purgatory. I don't know exactly what to do with it, but it's one of those tracks that it's just like, I hear it, I wouldn't be mad if somebody was listening to it in the car, but I probably wouldn't turn it on very often for myself. That's just how I'm feeling about it, guys. It just feels a little bit limited all around in terms of the instrumental. A lot of keyboards, uh, a lot of electronics floating around as well, and those kind of poppy, sterile drum beats. Not really digging it all that much. I'm feeling like, 2.5, uh, maybe even a 3 out of 5. Let me know your thoughts on it in the comment section down below. Keep in mind this is all just my opinion, so let me know yours tastefully and respectfully in the comment section down below. Uh, don't forget to hit that like button while you're here. Subscribe to the channel because friends don't let friends go unsubscribed. I've got more videos coming for you very soon right here on Beyond AR TV, so make sure that you don't miss out on that. And other than that, I will see you very soon right here on Beyond AR TV.